here, it's Cheryl again. Today I want to give you a little tip about using Google with Kuali. So if on, on the Kuali project we use Google Apps for Business, which means if you use Google for anything else on your same computer as one you're trying to use Kuali with, um, things can get pretty hairy. So instead of having to have a Google personal browser like Firefox and a Google um, browser for your institution because maybe your institution uses Google Apps for Business as well and have a Kuali browser you can actually I know with Chrome I don't know about other browsers you can create multiple users so that you can have different instances of Google going on at the same time so for example this is my personal Gmail it's got a little ninja on it this is this is well this is the the script that I'm I'm starting to put together and it's got a little pizza on it and it's all in Chrome but they're signed into different things so you can see like this is Cheryl.Many@Quali.org and then this is my personal email it's a little different okay so how does this magic happen well if you first of all you have to download and install Chrome so I mean, if you're at Google and you say, hey, give me some Chrome, they say, sure, we have Chrome right here. And just go ahead and download it. Um, you can also get it for Mac, too, or whatever you're using. And once you have it installed and up and running, you go to the settings. And you can see that I'm signed in. I've kind of block this out here but you can see that I'm signed in and then under users you can have multiple people so you just go ahead and add a new user and you give it a, a name so like your name Kuali and you can make it something cool like this alien dude or whatever and that way you can get it all separate from your personal email and so when you do things like try and add a calendar it doesn't break everything that's that's that if you have any questions send me an email and or Skype and I'll help you out thanks bye hey and don't forget we have a quality student training Google Plus page that links up to a YouTube account so Wherever you want to watch it, you can watch it on our training page or on YouTube. We also have more information available here, and we'll try and keep things posting. So there's our contact info. Woohoo!